Here's your word for the day from Calvary in Lake Havasu. Visit us on the web at calvaryaz.com. Good morning, Calvary. Tony Valenti here to bring you today's word of the day. Now, yesterday we were told that we're the salt of the earth. Today, our word of the day tells us about being a light. In Matthew 5, 14 through 16, it says, You are the light of the world. A city set on a hill cannot be hidden, nor do people light a lamp and put it under a basket, but on a stand, and it gives light to all in the house. In the same way, let your light shine before others so that they may see your good works and give glory to the, your Father who is in heaven. This is a thought that's repeated in Mark chapter 4, verse 2, and twice in Luke, in chapter 8, 16, and in 1133. The point is that we have the Holy Spirit to help us reflect the light of God to a broken world. The reason we have the light is reflected through us by the Holy Spirit is to bring glory to our Father in heaven. Remember Romans 8.15 says, For you did not receive the spirit of slavery to fall back into fear, but you have received the spirit of adoption as sons by whom we cry, Abba, Father. And if God is our Father, the light which we want to bear, then how can we not do that proudly and knowing that the Holy Spirit is going to guide us? And as a light placed on a stand sheds light on everything around it, we need to shine with the light of the world. And if your light is growing dim or flickering, you can always recharge it by renewing your mind, as it says in Romans 12, too. I hope you've powered up your light and the power of the Holy Spirit so that you can bring glory to your Father in heaven. Have a blessed day.